All right, some people are stepping into the new year with new clothes and gadgets, and they're eyeing the fresh goals for 2020. But others are not so fortunate. 13 News Now reporter Megan Perrier shows us how you can help them out. It's just the beginning. People talk about New Year's resolutions. For some, it's losing weight or quitting bad habits. With the homeless, the most of Thing they're looking for is hope. Odell Younger is one of those people staying at the Union Mission Ministries in Norfolk. The year is 2020 uh, and yeah, I'm praying for the best for everybody and to have a much better year. That starts with a bed and warm food. Happy New Year. You got a place to lay your head at night and sleep. Grateful for where things are headed. Everybody's looking for something better and uh, to uh, to wish the best for everybody else. That's why I said I had a little tear in my eyes. <laughs> it's a wish Linda Jones shares. Today is January 1st. There's the situation they came in yesterday is still the situation they're in today. For all 500 men, women, and children staying in the shelter tonight in need of clothes, toiletries, and support. The holidays can be a, a lonely and depressing time for people who are homeless. But it's that faith and hope that keeps them going. The idea not to think of things, but to think of people in the new year. And that's what we're looking for, people to continue to support us after the holidays are over, to give that hope to those people that come in our door, not knowing anywhere else to turn. In Norfolk, I'm Megan Perrier, 13 News Now.